now we can actually run our program to see if it works or not so let's run our code Welcome back Mac. The current time is 1 hour 40 minutes and 54 seconds. The current time is 1 hour 40 minutes and 59 seconds. 26 8 2021. Good night sir. Jarvis at your service. Please tell me how can I help you? So now you can see that it is initially in the off condition as the light bulb first turned on and then turned off again to stay in the turned off condition the reason is that as the arduino is powering on it changes its values from 0 to 1 repeatedly for stabilizing itself so for this reason the light bulb turns on and off in the start so now i can see to the my Jarvis. Time is 1 hour 41 minutes and 49 seconds the current time is since the time one was in the statement and 54 that's seconds. why it is telling me the time so Jarvis turn on the light the current time is 1 hour 42 minutes Again, and 7 seconds the time seconds. was in the statement the first so it will first tell me the time 1 hour 42 minutes and 11 seconds Jarvis turn on the light turning on the light see working Jarvis turn off the light turning off the light now to test our exit program I will again turn on the light so Jarvis turn on the light exiting the program now to check our exit statement, I will turn it on again. See, it turned on. Welcome then it back, Matt. The condition. current time is one hour forty three minutes and twelve seconds. The current time is one hour forty three minutes and sixteen seconds. Twenty six eight twenty twenty one. Good night, sir. Jarvis at your service. Please tell me how can I help you? Jarvis, turn on the light. Turning on the light. Jarvis, exit the program. Exiting the program. See, when I exited the program, it automatically turned off so our code is working properly into its full extent so in the next section we will discuss how to implement this whole program using our mobile app by creating an app with an on and off button and when the on button will be clicked the light will turn on and when the off button is clicked the light will turn off and after creating a simple app, we will move forward to our voice recognition app, which will be our final project in this course for now. So now to add any more devices, like if we have a two channel relay or more than two channels, like four channel or eight channel, which can allow us to control more electronic devices at the same time. For this scenario to add more devices to our arduino board and to control them using python we can use this statement right here to write the input to that means with which our relay input is connected like if i say relay 2 is connected to pin number 4 so i can say board or digital 4 dot write whatever you want you can use this as an example for your other electronic devices if you want now let's move forward to our next project which is home automation using a mobile app a simple mobile app